Hello viewers, welcome to the channel Auto Industry Guide. In this video, we will learn about the big three of American auto industry. So let's begin. American automotive industry started in 1890s and due to the size of the domestic market and use of mass production, it rapidly evolved to become the world's largest automotive market in the world. It held the title of the largest automotive market for the next eight decades until overtaken by Japan in 1980s. During the eight decades of domination, the big three of the American automotive industry were virtually the big three in the world automotive scenario. Till 1950s, 80% of the automotive production in the world was on American soil. Since 1950, the production of automotives has rapidly decreased. Nevertheless, American automotive industry is still the world's second largest automotive market behind China. So let's start with the first of the big three, General Motors. General Motors, commonly known as GM, is the world's fourth largest automotive company in the world after Volkswagen Group, Toyota and Hyundai Motors. It was the world's largest automotive company from 1931 till 2007. In the past few years, General Motors has pulled out of low profit markets of Europe and sold brands of Opel and Voxel to PSA Group. It has also pulled out of loss making markets of Australia, India and Thailand to concentrate on its home market. General Motors has undergone series of reforms internally and has shifted focus on electric vehicles and advanced autonomous driving. It owns four brands, Chevrolet, Buick, GMC and Cadillac. The next company in the big three of American automotive industry is Ford. Ford is US second largest and world's fifth largest automotive company. Henry Ford revolutionized the auto industry in the start of century by expanding and refining the concept of assembly line. Ford Model T was a grand success which made automotive affordable to middle class Americans. Ford once owned Volvo, Jaguar, Land Rover and Aston Martin and had to sell them during various financial crises. Now, Ford owns brands Lincoln Motors and Troller. The last American big three is Chrysler. Chrysler is a subsidiary of Fiat Chrysler Automobiles. It is the world's eighth largest automaker. The original Chrysler was started in 1925 by Walter Chrysler. In 1998, it was famously acquired by Daimler to form Daimler Chrysler and was devested in 2007. In 2014, it merged with Fiat to form Fiat Chrysler Automobiles, also known as FCA. FCA is soon merging with PSA to form Stellantis. An interesting development in the automotive industry and a topic for another video. Chrysler under FCA brand owns Dodge, Jeep and Ram. One notable mention in this discussion is Tesla Motors. Yes, Tesla Motors does not have the volume and the number of employees like the big three, but it is surely challenging the traditional automakers. Tesla's recent success at the stock market has has made it the world's most valuable automaker. Its worth was more than GM, Ford, FCA combined. Tesla Model 3 was the world's highest selling electric car ever. It surpassed Nissan Leaf in just 2.5 years after its launch. That's commendable given that Nissan Leaf has been in the market for over 10 years. Tesla Motors is surely going to demand its space as we move ahead in this decade. Will it challenge the big three in terms of volume production or will it create its own space as a luxury tech car company. Do let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more automotive content.